Why is it important to eat clean and to eat life-giving foods that God gave us? Things of the world, man-made foods, they're addictive. Concentrated drugs, they're addictive. Pharmaceutical drugs, extremely addictive. These are all man-made chemicals. These are all things that are not originally given to us by God, our Creator, in their whole form. And so they have addictive qualities, addictive natures. And so choosing clean eating and choosing only the things of God in their purest form doesn't have this addictive nature. And my, my kind of joke I like to tell people is, you don't see children throwing a temper tantrum in the fruit and vegetable aisle because mom or dad didn't buy them a pineapple. Now, I love pineapple. I can eat a whole pineapple in one sitting. I love the taste of pineapple. It's sweet, it's delicious, it's amazing. But it doesn't create addiction in me. Whereas uh, you eat a Oreo cookie or a candy bar and you never get satisfied. You keep getting pulled deeper and deeper into the addictive nature of this man-made creation, the spirit behind this man-made addictive creation, these things that aren't of God. And so you don't see children throwing temper tantrums in fruits and vegetable aisle, but you do see it in the candy aisle and the sugared cereal aisle and the processed food aisle. And I think that's important to understand that this is why we eat clean, because we don't want to uh, be subject to these man-made things that send us down the wrong path. And we have so many addictions and things that numb us from this world already in the area of TV and video games and uh, all of our electronic devices and pornography and just all of these, these things of the world that can uh, separate us from uh, things of the Lord. And, and food is one of them. It hasn't been talked about a lot, but I think it's time we address it and uh, really encourage you just to choose the things of God. Because if you're not careful, you'll get addicted to God. What an awesome place to be. What an amazing thing to be so, uh, I don't want to use the word addicted, but so in love with the things of God, with His creation, really enjoying salads and olives and pomegranates that are so delicious and pineapple and avocado and raw cacao and honey. Like, are you excited yet for so many beautiful, nutritious, life-giving foods that God gave us? Or is the chemicals in Oreo cookies and Doritos and soda pop so drawing you and tempting you that it's so addictive that you can't pull back from it. Clearly that's an issue and I've been there. Um, most people have been there and so this is a war, it's a battle and we want to choose the life-giving things of God because the more we do so, the more we fall in love with our God and that's what He wants. He wants us to fall in love with Him so much that we're connected with Him and only the things of God and that we're separated from all these things of the world that will destroy us and can destroy us. And so choose to, if you're going to be addicted to anything, be addicted to Jesus, the love of God, the, the creations of God um, that are so powerful. And, uh, and He will bring and restore life. And He will break these chains and this bondage um, that so many of us are struggling in relation to food and understanding uh, what foods are best for us. God bless you. Thank you for this journey. It's awesome. Loving it. Go Jesus.